Doesn't matter whether you live in a house, a flat, or a boat, it's love that turns wherever you live into a home. Good morning, guys. It is Friday, April 22nd, 2022. Ah, Harry Styles tickets go on sale in like 36 minutes and I am freaking the f out. Like, how am I meant to be calm? We have 36 minutes until these tickets go on sale. I have to get tickets. Like, I have to get tickets. I'm getting tickets. Manifesting. <sighs> My computer screen has looked like this for the last like two and a half hours. Like I am so ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready at all. I'm so, like I'm not ready, but I'm ready. Now all we have to do is wait. This is Cal's setup. He's got the Safari and the Chrome window ready to go. Cal just goes, what if our computers run out of battery? Mine's like not even plugged in. My charger's right here. You're really on my 50% too. I feel physically ill. My feet are sweating. Wedding. Like, my feet have never sweat so much in my life. Hell! What? You can't let your computer go to sleep. It's not sleep on tour. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up and sweat everywhere. Gross. Sick. Disgusting. God, I know I'm a woman, but I never thought I'd be stressed out over the kitchen. One minute. One minute. No. 30 seconds. I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah. I don't want to be in the ring somewhere. Five, four, three, two. One. Guys, we're in the queue. I'm stressing out. Oh my God, there's 11,000 people in front of me. Ah! What about yours, Cal? Does it say how many people? 10,000. 10, okay, you're going better. This one, this one only has 2,000. 2,000. Okay, that is probably going to be the winner. Okay, that's probably going to be the winner. This one, you have 1,900. 1,900. Oh my God, okay. <laughs> 900. I only have 900 people ahead of me. 800. Yours has gone down. 300. 300. That one's, ah! that one's gonna go on first, for sure. Okay, 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 okay. Nine people! I'm in! I'm in! Ah! I'm in! Okay. Two, please, 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 please! No! Are we gonna try them here? Yeah, see if you can unlock them. Go down, go down, go down. Kitchen, yeah, yeah, unlock. Wow, I do not like that side of me that came out. Okay guys, we are on day three of trying to get Harry Styles Kitchen Pod tickets. Today is the general sale, so all the pre-sales are done. If we can't get pod tickets, we're obviously going for front floor. I'm so much more calmer today. I feel like it's because I know that we have tickets already, like we have rear floor tickets for his first show, so it doesn't really matter if we don't get tickets. Like I'm so grateful that we already have those. It is 40 minutes until they go on sale. I look so busted. This is what getting Harry tickets has done to me. Like it's destroyed me. <laughs> I talked a big game. I said I was calm. Now I'm like, okay, the stress is coming on. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Are you ready, babe? Yeah. I am not calm. I am not calm. Freaking out. Ah! Three, two, one. We're in the queue. Okay, 16,000 ahead of me. 8,000 ahead of me on Chrome. Oh my God. Ah! I have two front standing tickets for a second show in my car right now. Place order, place order, guys. Oh my God. Oh my God. Please, please, please work, please work, please work. <laughs> okay, we're not in the pod, but I'm so grateful. Thank you. It is officially two sleeps until we are seeing Harry Styles. Oh my gosh, it's so soon. Anyway, I have just driven to the hairdresser. It is so hot right now, that's why my face is so red. But I have just driven to my hairdresser. I'm about to get my hair done. Now look, I'm not getting my hair done for Harry Styles, but is it a coincidence that my roots need to be done two days before the concert? I'll let you guys decide on that one, but I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, honestly, I'm in just such a good mood. I'm in such a good mood. Okay, let's go though, because I do need to be in there in eight minutes. Okay guys, this is my hairdresser Pia. She is the mastermind behind my hair. So what I think we're going to do is a three quarter head. Your ends are clearly so blonde from last time and you've been doing all your homework. You treat <laughs> Such a good student. <laughs> we want a really soft blend these days, not going too, too blonde. We want the regrowth to come through really softly and we want to be blonde for Harry Styles. Yeah. So, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's like me up with the bleach as healthy as possible, <laughs> make me as blonde as possible for yes. hair. Let's, 
still nice and blended through the middle. Like it's not too harsh, not too to the root. Yeah. Like that's not even toned yet. True. Harry is gonna die. <laughs> Should we do a little egg? <laughs> <laughs> you just put it all over my face. Yeah. <laughs> I look like an egg so bad. I love you. Oh, my little egg. little egg. It's gonna hatch into a queen that Harry was born along with. That's the prettiest one. I feel like this. <laughs> <laughs> It's officially one sleep until Harry Styles. I'm so excited. Like, what do you mean the concert's tomorrow? But today they're doing an early merch stand at Marvel. It's from like 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. I honestly just want the tote bag. I don't think I want to get any t-shirts or anything like that. To my core, I am an Etsy merch girl for life. Like, the fans always do better than the merch team. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But that's a hill I'm willing to die on. So let's go and try and get this tote bag. I'm so scared it's going to sell out. Safe to say the early merch stand was packed. Oh my god, when I got there, the line was already so long. I was so glad that I bought my Kindle because damn this truly felt never ending but I will say when we got into the room they were playing Harry's house on repeat so there was kind of a vibe and everyone around you could tell was just so excited for the concert but in saying that, damn, this was a long line. Two and a half hours in line but we got the goods. I literally got two tote bags because I'd waited so long in line. I felt weird if I got to the front and was just like, hey can I get this one thing? I shouldn't think like that but I did and then I figured there's probably someone out there who wants a tote bag who couldn't get the merch or couldn't go to the show or something so I now have two but I absolutely love it anyway now that that's done I really want to go ahead and do my fake tan so that it's all done for tomorrow night I told you guys this in my night routine but I recently switched over to using all loving tan products and dude I am literally obsessed with them I will never go back to using any other tan ever again so this morning I exfoliated I shaved all that kind of stuff before I went to the merch stand so now I am ready to put my fake tan on also this is the exfoliating mitt that I use. I use it along with their Deluxe Tan Remover and those two products work so well together. I swear, as soon as you put it on, you scrub the tiniest bit and all of your tan just falls off. Whereas in the past, I have used other products and I've been left in the shower scrubbing and my skin literally starts bleeding and I still have tan on. Now, they recently came out with their 2 Hour Express Deluxe Bronzing Mousse in Ultra Dark. So I'm gonna go in and use this one today. I did used to use just their normal Deluxe Bronzing Mousse in Ultra Dark. But what I love so much about this is that you only have to leave it on for two hours And that's the only difference between these two is how long you have to leave it on for and I really don't want to sleep in my tan tonight I kind of just want to like get it over and done with this afternoon So let's go ahead and use this now the way I do my tan is I put two pumps onto an applicator mitt This one is from loving tan as well And then I rub this into my skin in circular motions So I start with my legs and then make my way up my body The reason that I do this is that so when I bend I don't smudge any tan I would have if I had to put tan up higher on my body and what is so good about this tan is that it has the color guide you can see exactly where you've put the tan so you'll know if you've missed a spot I see so many people have rough times using clear tans with no color guide I just don't think I could handle the risk also this tan dries really quickly faster than any other brand I've ever used in the past which I appreciate because I hate being sticky I remember times where I'd literally put on tan and then stand in front of a fan to dry it. Can anybody else relate? I really hope so. It's also waterproof as well when it fully develops. Now the real tea is that this mousse contains these two ingredients and these work together to eliminate orange tones. So a lot of the tans you'll find will only use DHA. So that's why a lot of them leave you with that really orange fake tan look. Whereas Loving Tan uses both ingredients and that's why this tan leaves you with a really nice natural olive color. So with this tan specifically, once it's on, I leave it for two hours and then I rinse it off and this is what the color looks like once it's rinsed off it looks so natural and nice thank you so much to loving tan for sponsoring this portion of the vlog let's get back to getting ready for Harry Styles it is literally less than 24 hours until Harry Styles steps on stage and I have not stuck sequins on my heart glasses I decided that I was gonna do this months ago and I specifically said to myself I want to do this well before the concert that way if anything goes wrong I have time to fix it but I have not done that, but it's fine. We're gonna do it together now. So these are the supplies. I got these rhinestone gem things from Spotlight. I actually also got this glue from Spotlight as well. So 
time for a little, I was gonna say craft noon, but it is literally 9 p.m. So time for a craft and night, I don't know. <laughs> it's gonna be fine, it's gonna be fun. I believe in us. <gasps> Wait, they're like kind of glued together, Cal. Guys, I just went to start and I realized, see these rhinestone things? It looks like they're individually on there, but they're actually attached as a strip. So I can just pull one of the strips off and stick that around the glasses like I don't have to do each individual rhinestone. This could change everything. Wow, I knew I left it to the last minute for a reason. Yeah, literally do that. As you go around, push each one on at a time, I think. Wait, this is such a game changer. Guys, guys, oh my god, guess what I just did? I'm literally still in shock. I just bought a kitchen pod ticket for tomorrow night. <laughs> I'm still in shock. I just finished crying. I didn't even know that I was going to cry. Like, I've been looking for one. Also, it's Harry Day. Like, we're literally seeing Harry tonight. I look crazy. But anyway, I do need to find one more kitchen pod ticket for tomorrow, though, because I'm going with my sister. And right now, I have two front GA tickets, one kitchen pod ticket, and I need to find another one and sell those other tickets. Oh my god, I'm just in shock. Actually, you know what? I can't believe we're seeing wet leg tonight. I've been waiting for so long to see them. Oh my god gonna be so good but we really really need to get ready i don't know if i've given you guys the proper rundown i guess of what's actually happening so tonight i am going with cal and one of my friends we have general admission tickets like front ga tickets and our plan is basically just to get there around like 5 36 and just stand wherever we're really not fussed about getting barricade or being really close to the front or anything like that we kind of just want to hang out and dance and vibe and just have a good time and then tomorrow i'm going with my sister and we originally had the same tickets that i I have tonight except I have now upgraded one of my tickets to kitchen pod and I'm manifesting that I'm somehow gonna get another one so then both of us will have those tickets so that is the plan it just broke off <laughs> my makeup is all trash Okay, hair and makeup are done and my curls are so intense right now, but I've sprayed them with hairspray I don't want to brush them out until the last minute because I don't want them to drop like heaps But I need to put my outfit on. I'm so excited to show you guys my outfit Okay guys, this is the fit. Oh my god, this is actually the first time I've ever put it on and I'm literally so obsessed Okay, so this dress I actually borrowed it from this app called biz It's where you can rent out clothes and you can also rent your clothes as well I highly recommend it. It is so good. I love sustainable practices like that Like you don't necessarily need to buy something new for an event. Someone already has what you want So that's where the dress is from. I think it's from house of CB as well Like that's the brand and then I have these white boots from princess Polly. I have not worn them before I'm low-key scared they're gonna give me blisters. I don't even know how I'm gonna boot scoot in them. And then I of course have this feather boa. I sprayed so much hairspray on this so I'm hoping the feathers don't come off. I have these glasses that I got from this shop called I Love This Shop in Melbourne and then I stuck the sequins on last night. And then these watermelon earrings I got off Etsy. I'm literally so obsessed with this. Ah! It's like everything I envisioned. This is what my vision board was and I feel like I've slayed. Ah! I can't believe this is actually happening. Okay, it is 5.45, we're about to leave. I have all of our boas in this bag because it's like 36 degrees outside. It is way too hot to wear them. And I low-key also have a toasted sandwich that I'm taking with me for the walk because I'm so hungry. But let's go, let's go, let's go. This is what life looks like on the red planet. That is like insane. I don't know it's how you wear those glasses. <laughs> Guys, we made it. It's like 6.30 now and wet leg doesn't come on till like 7.50. So we've got a little bit of time. The lines actually aren't that bad. I guess because like everyone was lining up so early and has already gotten in. I'm so excited. <laughs> the vibes here are so good. Everyone is dressed up so nicely. Oh my gosh, the outfits are so good. Yeah, I made it. It took like six hours. The ones that they sell, they only do one size, which is like six. It's like two kilos. And then we just spent ages in our apartment peeling the plastic off of which our floor is covered in plastic. Oh my, you look so good though like, and the boots and the Slay. oh my gosh where are you tonight inside um, 
VIT like front row seat. Um, uh, slave, slave. Queen, oh my god, thank you so much for letting me film as well. Have the best night. You look so good. Oh, are you guys in wedding dresses? Wait, the sign. I love this so much. Oh my gosh, have fun guys. Wait, are we in the wrong bit? This is the alien. Not us all going in the wrong bit. Hi there. Hi. Wait, it's so dark right now. Hello. What song are you manifesting for tonight? Medicine. What song are you manifesting? Medicine and fine medicine. line. Oh, yes, yes. If you had to choose between fine line and medicine? Medicine. Yeah, More medicine. Dance. Medicine, medicine. I am manifesting Canyon Moon. I don't like my chances, but I'm still manifesting. <laughs> I'm also down for women, if you play Yeah, like that, yeah. Any of the unreleased songs? Yeah. That's that Anna or something. Like, I'm so yeah. down for it. Wonderful memories here. Thank you so much. I have a feeling tonight it's going to be no different. Thank you so much for being with us. I would like to start with a disclaimer that I will not be doing a shoey this evening. If you were running around up here for an hour and a half, you wouldn't be doing a shoey either, let me tell you. I've done my first and only shoey. And it was truly, truly revolting.
I got an injection in my bum so I can see you. Feels like there's a story. You don't need to go into it now. You shaved for this. Wow. You're being appropriate to tell me that so did I. I did. Or did I? There's not really a lot of ways to transition from that, is there, I suppose. Now, I want to thank you all. For all the support you've given me over the years, every single time I've been down here in Australia, you have been so incredible to me. The next song I'm going to play for you means a lot to me. I hope that one day it might be a little bit special to you as well as to me too. Future generation. Are you proud of yourself? <laughs> I am actually, I really am. <laughs> What's your name? Fove. Fove sign says, help me come out. My mum's next to me and dad is level two, section 41. I feel like I could help. I feel like she might know. No, I mean, I've just said it, it's on the screen. But would you like us to go through our love on tour coming out process? <laughs> this is the first time we're taking this down under, so prepare yourselves. Everything's gonna be upside down. Can I get some coming out music, please? Are we coming out like that tonight? Okay, here we come. Can I get some sparkles, please?
You've been absolutely incredible. Thank you so, so much. Guess what I'm doing right now? <laughs> Never did I ever think I would be telling you that I'm doing this right now, but I am icing my feet because my feet are so sore after wearing my boots last night. I had not worn those boots before. To be fair, they were pretty comfortable and I managed to do the boot scoot in them, but now my feet. Well, actually, they're not too sore now. They were so sore last night. I literally had to take my boots off to walk home and I like walked home in my socks. But I iced my feet last night before I went to bed and I swear it's helped because they're so much better today. And like the very responsible person that I am, I want to wear the white boots again tonight. So I'm like ice rolling these like crazy trying to prepare them to be destroyed again. But 
Tonight is going to be Harry Styles Melbourne night two. I'm so excited, dude. I managed to get my sister a kitchen ticket, like a kitchen pod ticket. So we will both be in the kitchen tonight. I'm very, very, very excited about it. Oh my God, it's gonna be good. But it's like 11.30 now. I'm honestly still kind of waking up. I didn't get to sleep until like 3 a.m. last night. So I kind of need to pull myself together though. Cause I have this feeling that I'm just gonna sit here and then all of a sudden it's gonna be like 4 p.m. and I'm like, oh my God. But anyway, round two, baby, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Can that truck, like, no? It's going to be really hot again today, except there's cloud and it's forecasted to rain, which, I mean, is not ideal, but also a sign of the times in the rain would be absolutely iconic. Oh my God, I just realized the dress that I'm wearing, if that gets wet, I think it would be completely see-through. Stop. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, anyway, that is a later problem. For now, I'm just gonna focus on getting ready. I'm also drinking this massive glass of water. I'm gonna try and get through a couple of these because I am so dehydrated from last night. We bought a drink when we got there as well. I'm like putting so much moisturizer on. I feel like my face needs it. We got a drink when we got to the concert last night. So I think I had three drinks total. So I wanna make sure I'm like super hydrated tonight before I get there. What was I saying? Oh yeah, last night I wore my hair down, but I packed a hair tie and as soon as we did taken photos i shoved my hair up because it was so hot so i think i'm gonna do the same thing again tonight same makeup same hair pack a hair tie but a different outfit that hopefully will be okay to wear with the rain <laughs> but let's speed through the makeup let's get this done boob tape on my boobs right now to try and like keep them in place with this dress I literally ran to the chemist an hour ago because I put on this dress and it just wasn't it wasn't doing what it needed to do so this is what we're working with I'm wearing the same boots as last night honestly I feel like icing my feet last night and this morning helped so much because they really don't hurt that bad they're definitely gonna hurt a lot tomorrow but we are pushing through I also have these disco ball earrings that I got from spotlight and then these glasses I got off eBay but then I did obviously the rhinestone situation but I'm myself you guys saw that already and then this dress is from princess polly and we're going with the same boa from last night i think the hairspray actually helped but i'm going to drink this espresso martini q is ready to go as well <laughs> it's gonna be good all right let's go oh i wonder where we're going tonight you can't really tell by how we're dressed it's a secret it's a secret oh you'll never guess it as we walk by marvel stadium <laughs> Okay, we just got to Marvel. It is low-key raining, but it's fine. We just need to go find the gate that we're checking in at because it's different than yesterday. Okay, guys, we got it inside. I got this lanyard and that is part of my ticket because I just bought whatever ticket came up on ticket slot and turns out it was actually like a VIP ticket. So we like check in and she was like, are any of you VIP? I'm like, yeah, but like, so my ticket came with early entry, but I was like, I don't want early entry. Obviously, we want to like come in together. So I'm just like awkwardly get my like lanyard and bag. I'm like, okay, stay. Now we're inside. We're just kind of like chilling up here before we go into the pod because it is pouring rain right now. And also like, we don't really care where we are in the pod. As long as we're in the Slay. Slay, slay, slay. Okay, we're walking into kitchen. It kind of feels like we're not meant to be here. I couldn't feel it. It feels like when you're walking into school late and everyone's just staring at you. No, I feel like I'm I feel VIP, bitch.
to be whoever it is you've always wanted to be in here tonight we're gonna have fun we're gonna do it together is everyone okay before we start is everybody hydrated are we all here with uh i don't even know what i was gonna ask you are you well yeah all right let's go
much, Melbourne.
the Harry Styles aftermath when you have to take your shoes off to get home. <laughs> Honestly, two nights of these. Hello. My feet are so done. <laughs>